Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Two dead after boat hits buoy on the Piscataqua River. Two passengers were killed and two others were injured after investigators said a boat on the Piscataqua River struck a buoy Saturday night. Two roses have been placed at the Elliott Boat Landing as a memorial for the two lives lost. New Hampshire State Police received a call about a boating accident with a missing person near the area of Elliott Boat Landing in Elliott, Maine at 8.15 p.m. After a follow-up call, police said it was revealed that all four people on the boat were accounted for. Multiple agencies responded to the scene, including New Hampshire State Police, Marine Patrol, and U.S. Coast Guard. According to investigators, a 59-year-old man was operating the 24-foot Boston Whaler when it struck a buoy, throwing one female passenger into the New Hampshire side of the river. She was reportedly wearing a life jacket at the time. Coast Guard officials said with the warmer weather comes more activity on the water and they urge boaters to use extreme caution. The operator was transported to a hospital in York, Maine, while three passengers were taken to Portsmouth Hospital. Officials say two female passengers were pronounced dead. The other passenger was later transported to a hospital in Boston, Massachusetts for further treatment. With the incident is still under investigation, authorities believe operator intention may have been a factor. The identities of the victims have not been released. And that does it for my evening news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your Sunday night, and I'll see you back here tomorrow with more news reports. Good night, everyone. Bye.